Hey guys, Dan with Northern Outdoors TV here. Today, I just want to talk to you a little bit about my Hummingbird Ice 45 Flasher that I've had for about three years now. One of the things that I really liked about it was that it came with a soft-sided carrying case. Some of the things that I like about the case are that it has these big pockets on each side, which can fit quite a bit, whether it be your bait pucks, your small tackle boxes, or maybe even a beverage of your choosing. Another thing that I like about this is that it has really durable zippers with easy access to the battery and an integrated area for your handle here so you can easily pick up and go when you're hole hopping and running and gunning on the ice. Some of the features I'd like to show you about this unit are first, the transducer. It comes with a 9 and 19 degree beam angles that's standard with the unit. The next thing would be this center LCD display. It automatically shows whatever depth you're at to the nearest tenth of a foot, which is really nice when you're hole hopping or running and gunning out there. Because you can quick just drop your deucer in the hole and you can see right there, boom, there's your depth. Move on to the next hole. Another feature is being able to select the beam, whether it be wide or narrow. And the same button when you depress it for two seconds will also show you the percent battery you have left. And then after a few couple seconds it will return back to the previous screen. It also has 10 levels of noise rejection which all you have to do is hold the button and then you can select how much uh, interference or rejection that you want to utilize in that spot. This can also be switched between feet and meters. Your gain, which can be set from 1 to 40, <clears throat> is also useful when you're trying to zone in on those fish. And it also doubles as a backlight for when you're fishing at night or if your shack doesn't have lights. It's super useful because it not only gives you a better uh, readout as far as where your lines are on your unit, but you can see your center LCD display even better. And the feature that I like the most about the unit would be the zoom feature, which allows you to zone in on a certain area of the water column, so you can better see the separation between your bait and the fish that you're going after. The maximum amount of target separation you can get, or the distance between the lines on the flasher, is two and a half inches. And that would mean that when you see a space in between two lines, the smallest distance that it will actually be down in the water is two and a half inches. Any less than that, and the lines are going to start to overlap. So you know when you're, you have a fish, you're jigging a fish up, and all of a sudden those you know, two lines become one. That fish is right on that bait, less than two and a half inches. This unit itself, with a 7 amp hour battery, is rated by Hummingbird to get potentially 28 hours of runtime. That's obviously without using the backlight or anything like that. <clears throat> Me personally, with the three years of use I've had, I've seen to get anywhere from 20 to 24 hours of battery life before I have to charge it. Which is great if you're out for a weekend fishing or whatnot, because then you don't have to worry about charging your battery constantly. The Hummingbird Ice 45 retails in right at $399.99. And when thinking about all the features that it has compared to a lower end unit, $399 is quite the bargain compared to maybe higher end units that have only a couple more features than this one has. So. If you like this video and you'd like to see more, remember to like, comment, or subscribe to Northern Outdoors TV. Thanks for watching, folks. Northern Outdoors.